Hey oh, it's Omnidog here, back with another overview. That's right, this time it's The Amazing Spider-Man Beyond Omnibus. And I believe this is the Art Adams cover. There were three covers. Um, I guess this is probably the best one. It's hard to... I, th they weren't really all that great, the covers. This is the least offensive. This one's pretty cool. Um, so, front, spine, this is nice. Amazing Spider-Man Beyond. In the back. Oh, ho! Ben Riley is back in the reds and blues. This is a book I have zero idea. None. Nothing. Nada. I know nothing about this book, so let's learn together. Let's, okay, we'll take the dust jacket off. Aha, spectacular creators unite for a chapter of Spidey storytelling that's beyond amazing. So this sounds like it's a bunch of creators. Oh, and here they are, the creators. Let's show, ooh, this is nice. Well, that looks cool. What? Uh, oh, that is really boss. Okay, so let's see who these creators are. Zeb Wells, Kelly Thompson, Saladin Ahmed, Cody Ziegler, Patrick Gleason, Jed McKay, Sarah Pacelli, Mark Bagley, Mike, Michael Dowling, Carlos Gomez, Jorge Fornes, Paco Medina. Okie doke. So there is the cover, and this, actually, this is a really cool, I like, I think I like this more than the cover, the dust jacket, rather. Okay, so let's open this up. This book is a little bit over 600 pages, uh, around 642-ish, I would say. Price is $100, so it's... Um, Maybe it's a little thin for that price, but it's also not as thin as like Planet of the Apes or something for a hundred dollars. So you you get a decent chunk. Let's see what what we've got in here, and we'll look at the spine. Sorry, the binding in just a sec. So here we talk now. I've been told by Fast Freddy, one of my top three Puerto Rican friends, that this is the book you read after Nick Spencer's Spider-Man run. Now, Omnibus One is out now. Today is sometime in August 2023. I have no idea what the date is. I don't need to. That's not important. Um, okay, so you're supposed to read it afterwards. If you want to read it now, go ahead. Just know you get an update here on Peter Parker. And you get an update here on Ben Riley. So you get Amazing Spider-Man, Zeb Wells, Free Comic Book Day, Zeb Wells, Janine, Kafka, Love and Monsters, Kelly Thompson. Oh, that's all in Free Comic Book Day. Nice. Amazing Spider-Man 77 through 8 is Kelly Thompson. Ooh, Kelly Thompson and Sarah Pacelli. What a team up. Jeb McKay, Cody Ziegler, Sp Amazing Spider-Man. Amazing Spider-Man, Cody Ziegler, Saladin Ahmed, Saladin Ahmed, Amazing Spider-Man 3, Patrick Gleason, writer and artist. So here are all of those talents that I told you about. Pretty darn good lineup. Uh, there's Kelly Thompson and Sarah Pacelli again. I'm already going to like those issues. And it goes through... It also includes, oh, Mary Jane and Black Cat Beyond. Oh, that's Jed McKay and C.F. Villa. Um, let's, I did relax the spine. Thank you. So let's check. Oh, it's got Morbius in it. Let's see if we can journey to the center of the book. That's not it. Come on. Get a grip, dude. Okay. Not much of an eye, but that's okay. Let's see what the 
Gutter loss is like in the center. Ooh, black hat, I'm in. Um, let's flip to earlier and see what the gutter loss is like. Okay, this isn't too bad for early on. Doc Ock and Aunt May, okay. Uh, good. That's not bad. No, the gutter loss is really actually pretty good on this book. So, here are the things I know about Ben Riley. I think that's him. That's it. So, <laughs> I, <laughs> I do have really cool action figures of him, though. So, I do know him a little bit through there. So, we're just going to take a look. I told you who the writers were. So let's take a look and see what the art is like. And maybe figure out if the story's interesting. I like the art so far. Peter's in the hospital for some reason. Ooh, that's boss. I like this expression in the eyes. Or is that what his costume is like? With super squinty eyes. Oh, no. Okay, cool. I dig that. Beyond Training Facility. Ah, right. It says... In this, the Beyond Corporation, owner of the Spider-Man trademark, has installed ed, has installed everyone's favorite clone as its official web slinger with a new suit and some nifty upgrades. But where does that leave Peter Parker? Is the neighborhood big enough for both of them? Or will things turn decidedly unfriendly? Featuring Black Cat, Mary Jane, Good, Good, Miles, Morbius, Craven, Dr. Ock, Doc Ock, and the shocking debut of Queen Goblin. So that is what this is. Beyond Training Facility is somehow his sponsor. I, that's an interesting idea. I can, I can, I can dig that. You got to, things have to be different, you know? You can't stay static. Things, you got to have new ideas. Oh, and here's Spider, I mean, <laughs> Morbius. Uh-oh. Spoiler alert. Sorry. Let's see if I can flip so you don't find out. Good. Oh, Black Cat and Mary Jane. Hmm. Okay. I dig this Beyond Corporation idea. That's a very ooh, good piece of art. Nice. Beyond Corporation Pocket Battlefield Patent Pending. Um. Hmm. This looks really cool. Whoa! Do not. Antimatter Bomb. Not for mass market. Things are. Some things are. Something's going on at Beyond Corporation, man. I'm starting to get interested. I. You know, it's okay with me if it's Ben Riley. Look at this art. <gasps> Whoa, who the heck's that? That's a pretty cool character. Oh, and this is what the book cover is based on. Mm hmm. Well, I don't know what's going on there, and I don't know who Janine is, but that was pretty cool. Hmm. Parker's still in the hospital throughout this whole thing? Uh-oh. What's happening here? 
I had no idea his middle name was Benjamin. I, I would fail that in trivia. Well, now I know. Well, a sentient something. <laughs> That's cool. Looks like Doc Ock is getting into it. Cool. Hmm. Uh oh. Is that the Queen Goblin? I guess so. I like the idea. And man, I like the colors. This is really well colored. Really bright and popping. Goblin's gaze. Ooh. I don't want to spoil it, so let's skip to whatever's happening here. Ah, they're both back in action. Nice. My big, beautiful robot brain. What's going on there? Okay, so... Let's see what the extras are like. Are there any extras? Oh, it looks like there are some nice extras. Come here, you guys. What are you doing? Uh-oh, spoiler alert. Covers. Man, how cool would it be to be a cover artist? Hey, what do you do for a living? I draw covers for comic books and get paid gobs of money. What do you do? Work in an office or something? Mm-hmm. Pretty cool job. Wow. That's a Peach Momoko. Oh, okay, I can tell there, but that's interesting. Very neat. Oh, that's a cool costume. Okay, I don't want to spoil all the cover. Okay, it's nothing but covers. Printing variants, covers, lots of... Ooh. I think I have one of these. Ah, I have this one. The Adam Hughes one. This is a great cover. Oh. Yeah, and I forgot. Go to Organic Price Books. Use code OmniDog for $2 off. With my code, yeah. 5% off. Big savings here. Shipping three or more books together with code OmniDog. Ship it together. So, it's covers. A lot of cool covers. So, there we go. That's Amazing Spider-Man Beyond. A book featuring Ben... Riley, the favorite Spider-Man of a certain Mississippian toy collector named T. Lar Blunt. And there you go. I hope you enjoyed this interview. Peace and love, peace and love, Omnidog's Vault. I also have a Discord. Ha! I wonder what it's like in there. And Instagram. Peace and love, peace and love. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Peace and love. Be good to each other.